step one, my name is Erin and this is Jimmy, one of the ferrets that lives here at our zoo. So ferrets are a very popular pet, but I'm going to try to teach you something you may not have already known. For example, the name ferret actually comes from the Latin word ferritus, meaning little thief. Um, these guys are obligate carnivores, which means they actually have to eat meat in order to survive. Um, they can't only have vegetation. These guys are also part of the mustelid family, which means that they are related to badgers, uh, weasels, otters, all of those uh, animals with musky smells. And they actually use that musk as a defense mechanism. So they will use their scent glands to emit a musky smell in order to ward off predators. And the typical pet ferret that you would have at home actually came from the European polecat. And it's kind of um, a guess as to where they were first domesticated. One guess is from the Egyptians. Um, however, there are not any mummified remains of ferrets or any hieroglyphs of ferrets, so that does seem like less of a reasonable guess. Um, we do know, however, that Romans probably used them for hunting, and they were actually still used for hunting up until this day. Um, the UK actually has rabbits, which are considered a pest species by farmers, so they still use ferrets for hunting. And they were used in the United States to protect grain stores all the way up until World War II. Here in the United States, we have black-footed ferrets. Uh, they are the only species of ferret native to the United States, and they are very important. Um, they heavily rely on prairie dogs. Uh, so prairie dogs are very important to the ecosystem because they allow plant seeds to germinate. Uh, but if there are too many prairie dogs, they can actually cause erosion in grasslands. So the ferrets are very important because they take care of the prairie dog populations and make sure they don't overpopulate. Um, they also use those prairie dog tunnels in order to raise their babies called kits. Thank you guys for tuning in to our Wildlife Wonders at One with our ferrets. <laughs>